Well, I would have loved to have live cast my drive this afternoon. Problem is, for Facebook, uh, the quality falls apart when you're between cell phone towers. And for YouTube, you have to have a thousand subscribers and I don't have that. So the next best thing is to videotape it and play it back later. So it's about 5.50 p.m. Let's go back a few hours to the two o'clock hour and we'll pick up at that point. Well, greetings, the B3 burner and what I have for you today on this Monday, January 4th, 2021, Happy New Year, is a drive in the Crown Vic yet once again, just something to keep me occupied and, and uh, get me out of the house. I'm tired of being cooped up in this COVID ravaged world we live in right now. We were supposed to have the storm of the season today. It was billed as such. Why Channel 3 gave the weatherman almost 10 minutes commercial free to talk about how incredible this was going to be. And maybe it was something else north of Sacramento and Redding, but we, uh, we didn't get much here in Oakdale. Rather disappointed. Lay you a bet. This seat belt does its job better than that cold front did. So we're going to have a tour around and see exactly what this got us. I think the sun is starting to come out, which is not what I wanted to see. No siree. Not good at all. Okay. Close the garage door. Drive around the neighborhood, see what we got going on. Right now it's partly sunny. I would say 80% overcast. I see a patch of grayer skies to the south. But not much here. Too bad. Too bad. I like my rain. I like excitement when it rains. I like thunder and lightning. I like wind so long as it doesn't destroy people's property. We just are not a very exciting state. Place to the north. We seem to get what we want places to the south seem to get what we want. Santa Barbara and LA, when they get rain, they really get rain. Redding, Shasta County, Yuba City, they get their fair share of rain. We, just like we're in a rain shadow seems like the San Francisco Bay Area, with the exception of Marin County, North Bay always gets a little bit more rain. But immediately going east, Tracy, Modesto, Oakdale, where I am now, we always miss out. Always miss out. Last great rainstorm, I mean one that was for the headlines, that I remember coming through here, or through California was 13 years ago. January 4th. January 4th, 2008. And why do I remember that date? Well, I'm pretty good at remembering dates as it is, but I specifically remember that date because my job was to deliver petroleum to fuel tanks and I had a lot of emergency generators to fill because of the storm and on our work orders or the requisition slips that you send to the people you sell the fuel to I had to write 1408 on 
lots and lots of work orders. And I was up and down the state quite a bit. So, that's why I remember that date. Now that was truly a huge storm. 40 mile an hour winds through the Bay Area. Waiting for these left hand turners. 40 mile an hour winds through the Bay Area. Uh, heavy rain, moderate rain over an extended period of time. And when I say extended period of time, I don't mean for 30 minutes and then there's sprinkly showers. I mean six hours straight. And then pockets of heavy rain Oh, interspersed in 30 minute cycles, maybe a little bit more. I mean, it was a for real storm and we haven't gotten those in a long time. We've been having these backhand sliders slide down the coast or little impressions that sort of give us two hours of rain and then it stops or mostly in the mountains, storms that hit the Sierras and did a lot of good up there. Darn it, you know what I forgot? Bottled water. Oh well. I'll just die out there, so that's fine. Um, stuff that's good for the Sierras, but not necessarily good for the rest of the valley, like I said. Not very exciting for us. Where's that train coming from? I guess I'll go north. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I kind of cut in front of somebody and made a right hand turn on a red in front of it. Well, he'll do what he does. If he flips me off, I know why. Sorry, buddy. <clears throat> so I'm going to head north. See if we have any rain up this way. You know, I always miss all the good stuff. Always miss all the good stuff. Now, even if the valley doesn't get rain, but the Sierras does, that's good for snowpack, that's good for the reservoirs and the streams and rivers. So it's not like that hurts us any. But it's nice when the valley floor gets some too. And like I said, it's more exciting to watch. I like my thunder and lightning. I'll go out and chase it and take video of it if I can. That's been a little bit tough as of late. Ah, that looks pretty steady up there. I mean, it looks like a solid mass of gray. Rustling. So 
that's a good thing. I see a road I've never been on before, and that sort of piques my interest. So, we are going to give it a try. Let's see. So I decided to drive up to Angel's Camp from here up Highway 4. <coughs> from here I'm going to take 49 south down to Sonora and then 120 westbound back to Oakdale and that's the plan. <laughs> 